What up, camp folk? Let's talk about celery. Let's talk about celery juicing. Talk about the juicer, the celery, the whole kitten caboodle. Right? So this is celery, right? Everybody knows what it looks like. They know what it tastes like. Um, it's cheap. It's easy to find, and it's surprisingly life-changing good for you. We buy our celery, buy the case from uh, Kroger, a local Kroger in Murfreesboro, Tennessee. We bring it home, we cut it, we wash it, we bag it, we refrigerate it. That's the basic steps for prepping your celery. You wanna cut off the ends where it's kinda of leafy, and you wanna cut off the butts, and of course, if you've seen my videos, the bottom, the butts, we feed to the cows. The cows love it. Get you a juicer, it doesn't have to be this juicer, we use the Omega. Uh, we've also used like three or four different juicers. This is the one that we've been using for the past couple of years. Um, super easy to do, turn it on. It's gonna be a little noisy right now because it's about to chew this celery. Um, there's different kinds of juicers. This one right here gives us the best result and it gives us the best pulp to work with in other recipes. It has a very rewarding pulp rate. We go through, what, a case of celery a week, at least. So that's 30 bushels of celery in a week. And that's just between two people. We drink. 32 ounce glass uh, mason jars full of celery juice every day. And you can see the juice coming out down here and then the fiber right here. And I take this fiber and uh, I season it. You can see that it's, you know, you can kind of shape it out. If you season that with a little salt and pepper and some garlic powder, and you put that in the oven on some parchment paper, um, and let it kind of dehydrate on a low temperature. This is what I call leaf jerky. Season it however you want to. No different than beef jerky, but made from the scraps from your celery juice. I use this for the leaf jerky. I use this in my, my uh, patties that I make with uh, garbanzo beans and portobello mushrooms. And this uh, together, that's how I make my hamburger patties or my non-burger patties, whatever you want to call them. Veggie burgers, snow patties. So if you, if you haven't started juicing or you're thinking about starting juicing and you don't know like how to do it, it's the reason why I'm doing this video right here because if I can do it, anybody can do it, right? I'm not a smart guy. I don't have a master's degree in culinary arts. All right, so after several sticks of celery, we have our 32 ounce glass serving, which is, a it's my daily dose. Sometimes I'll do this twice a day, like end of the day, if I'm not feeling like having a full blown meal, or if I feel like I've eaten enough, like I'll, sometimes my lunch will go late and I'll have a big salad and like seven, I'm like, ah, I don't really feel like eating again. This right here will also, uh, fix that like late night craving because this right here is going to fill you up big time. 32 ounce uh, glass of celery juice is going to make you feel like you've had a lot. Um, so yeah, this is the daily dose. there will change the way you feel every day, I promise you.